Hey, g'day, g'day. Hello, hello, hello. We're back. Can we get a one in the chat, please, if you are here? Ah, oh, boy. All right. Let's jump in. Let's get, you know what? Let's buy a new outfit. Let's do a, let's, let's buy a new outfit. Where the fuck am I? I'm in the middle of goddamn, no, wait. No, this is Valentine right here. Okay, cool. Turn the volume up here. Uh, I'll tell you, I'll tell you Les's backstory. Well, at least a little bit of it. Uh, once we get a little bit more people in here and ready to go, I'll share a little bit about what Les is all about. Uh, that way you know. Um, because his backstory is important as to, uh, why and what he does. This is, this is, this is Les. Um, very innocent looking boy. I gave him a, a, a very thin body. Very young looking thin body. Um... He's 20 years old. Um, say hello to Les. I, I didn't, I was expecting a stream with him. This is actually, I'm actually a little nervous, uh, which is probably good. I can so kind of, uh, hello. <laughs> I, can, I, I can kind of maybe um, put that, some, some of that into the character a little bit. Um, he's a ranger. Yeah, he's a ginger. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. Um, so it's Les Darcy. Now, for those of you who don't know, Les Darcy is an actual person in real life that I idolize. Um, he's, a, he's a boxer from the 20s, an Australian boxer. Now, I'm not role-playing as that person. Obviously, I'm just using the name uh, because I, I, I love I love the name and uh, I think it's a cool name. And I've, all, and I've always idolized him. Uh, he's a boxer from the 20s in Australia that died at a very young age. I think he was in his 20s, maybe early 20s. Uh, he got he was in a boxing match and he knocked out his two front teeth and he got uh, some kind of poisoning um, like blood poisoning and it ended up killing him um, that's where I got the name from just a little backstory there but Les himself let me talk about Les let me just get some money out of the bank here so I can actually start getting changed and while we change I'll tell you a little bit about Les uh, I haven't filled out I haven't filled all his story out that'll happen over time but I've got enough that I can kind of tell you. Um, got a little bit of money. I've got to grab these coffees. One thing about Les is he carries coffees around that he gives to the deputies. Uh, so we'll take out $30. He's actually richer than Baz right now. <laughs> He's got more money than Baz. Yeah, not getting arrested helps. And not being a degenerate gambler also, also helps. Uh, let's go up here. Now... Les is my spirit animal. <laughs> yeah. Hey, Jenny. How you doing? Um, so, Les went on a date. The, the very first night I played Les, he actually got a date. And Banks gave him money to buy an outfit. And this is the outfit that he got. <laughs> which is Banks' outfit. So, we got Banks Jr. as, a, as an outfit. Um, yeah. He idolizes Banks. <clears throat> All right, let's uh, let's do a new outfit. Okay, so Les, uh, Les, uh, Les is a lonely child of uh, two parents. Um, one, the mother was named Elizabeth, father was named Husky, and Husky was a drunk. He was a gambler. Just he was not a very nice guy. And uh, he would he would beat Les um, for minor things. He in Les kind of tucked up into a shell. So Baz, yeah, pretty much. Um, he ended up killing Les's mother by throwing her off a balcony. And uh, when the law came around, uh, this was in Australia, by the way. When the law came around, uh, Les actually he actually ratted out his father. Uh, Les has actually spoken multiple times to Banks about how he would see his father beat his mother. And he would or he'd, he would try to stop it by jumping on his dad's back. But he wasn't strong enough or brave enough to save her. Uh, so his dad would just throw him off. Um, but when, when he murdered his mother, he told the police what happened. The police locked up his dad. And his dad told Les that when I get out, I'm going to fucking kill you. And so he's come to America to get away from his dad. He's terrified of his father. He, his father's in jail in Australia. 
but he's still terrified. Uh, that's all I can really tell you right now about Les. Other than he's also a very quick runner. Uh, it is canon that Les is a very quick runner and he would run around all the time, especially at school and win, win races. He was a very, he was a racer. He, he loves, he loves racing people. So, um, I always carry around, um, uh, gum that I can chew so I can run for longer because that's his character. Alrighty, we'll play Les's dad calling it now. If he can do the Aussie accent. If he can do the Aussie accent, fuck yeah. I'd be down. I think blue looks... Uh, I was talking about this with Sarah. I think blue looks good with red hair, right? Right? Let me go... We go vest with Les. Probably a vest, right? He's a, he's he's like a young he's a he's a he's a young man. He wears a vest. Like that, maybe. So that's why he's scared. He's been beaten his whole life. So when he sees like a uh, like an outlaw. The fucking beards and the fucking black and you know the, the 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 way they hold themselves and talk, it just reminds me of his dad, and he's fucking terrified. Cream vest. Yeah, I'm. I'm gonna say more boyish looking. Something boyish looking. I don't want him. Having, I don't want him having a pocket watch like that. I've ran to moon twice with Les. Actually, last time I ran to moon, um, Mama actually pushed Les over because they were having a conversation outside the saloon, and Les Les was peeking over. The, he was peeking over the window. To see what they were doing, and Mama came in and pushed him to the ground and threatened him with a knife, and he was fucking terrified. Poor kid. Here's some nice pants. Hmm. It's probably a bit dark, right? Bro, you ran close to home with throwing yourself and your father to stop him, her, your mother. Yeah, yeah. It, when he when he told when he told Banks that Banks was like, he, Banks didn't show much. Like he he just he, he what he told Les was stop calling that man your father. He said, don't call that man your father ever again. You have to earn that. You can't. You, you shouldn't just be calling him father. He doesn't deserve that. Um. So he hasn't called he hasn't called him father since. What about cream. Different vest, you reckon? Remember two. Remember two. Oh, he looks like a, he looks like a. What about the plaid? <laughs> How about the plaid? It works. Like a fucking ice cream man. Plaid is nice, actually. Love the plaid vest. Like that? Okay. Do you want a coat? I'll take the coat off when we actually play, but I might give him a coat. I want it to look sort of nice, but again, boyish looking, like the pinstripe, maybe? Maybe the blue, like that? What do you think? That's nice. Yeah. Now we're getting somewhere. Now we're getting somewhere. A uh, hat. <laughs> Give him a straw hat. <laughs> <laughs> Mm. 
<laughs> no. No. You can't... No. No, that's too much. It's too much. The flat cap... I think the flat cap might be the way to go, too. Like that? I do like that. I do like... It's coming blue, though. Like the same shade. Or cream. Oh, it doesn't. Ah, uh, I do like that look, though. I do like that look. Ah, uh, it doesn't come in the same blue. Fuck. We go black. It's like a newspaper boy. That's what I want. That's what I want. That's what I want. Yes, yes, with the black. Okay, he's got to wear a tie. Like a little, like a little bow. Or can you not do that with this shirt? Oh, that would suck. Like that. <laughs> He's a chimney sweep. 36. Remember 36. That looks good. That looks good. What do you think of that? I think that's it. Uh, where are the shoes, man? I, did I miss the shoes? Yeah, I did. There we go. That was fucking easy. Gun belt? Oh yeah, wear, he's gonna wear a gun. I'm thinking darker shoes, honestly. I'm thinking darker shoes like that. Higgy blinders? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, that was, yeah, brown. Boom. Boom! Boom! Uh, cloaks? Nope. Gun belt? Nothing too fancy. Like that looks okay-ish, I think. Let me just see. No, actually that, no, not that one. Not the string, or the rope, that's for sure. That'll do. Told you blue is good. Yeah, it looks good. Are we in agreement with this, or, do we, or should we change the pant color? I don't know, eight. What do you think of the blue? Blue or cream? What do you think? Nine or eight? Mm. Too much blue? Cream? Okay. Alright. I think we're good. Blue Les. I don't know if I want to wear this now, though. Maybe we should just go with our normal look. That was what, That's what he originally looked like. Oh, God, he was wearing the chaps. And he walked into town, and he first, one of the first people he ran into was fucking Danny. And Danny made fun of him. And he caught, he goes like, you're a bully. The Danny, and Danny's like, I'm not a bully. Yes, you are. And you're a son of a bitch. <laughs> Fight me, Danny. I don't think we wear this yet. I think it looks too fan. Oh, I don't know. I kind of like it. I kind of like it. You hated that ending? Peppo. Peppo, can I ask you a question? Okay. Did he do it on purpose or was he legit scared? What's your theory? Was he was he was he legit scared or did he do it for the kids? He did it on purpose because of that asshole priest? Yeah, he didn't want he didn't want dude, he didn't want uh he didn't want the kids to follow his same path, bro. It's fucking devastating. Oh. Did you like the movie though?
Watch a movie with the worst ending. Oh. <laughs> Dude, how good is his acting, though, during that scene? Like, you don't even see it happen. Just the sound. Oh, dude. Like, when I was a kid and I watched that, that, like, scarred me. It was a movie called Angels with Dirty Faces. You love this caddy, man? Dude, I, oh, I knew you would. I fucking knew you would. He's the best, man. He's my favorite actor. Uh, if you watch my YouTube videos, Peppo, I always intro my videos with what do you hear, what do you say? Because of that movie. Because of that movie. What's the next one to watch? Uh, there's a movie called Public Enemy. That's his very first movie, Public Enemy. Well, it's the first movie he starred in. It was the starring role. Uh, definitely check that out. Public Enemy. That might be, the, it, might, it might even be considered his best gangster movie. Um, but I wanted to start you off with a couple of movies with Bogart in it because uh, you, you know Bogart. And Bogart's such a good fucking weasel in those movies. Evening, gentlemen. Nice day for a murder. I'm gonna I'm you I'm using that as Baz soon. I'm gonna walk into I'm gonna walk into the sheriff's office. Evening evening deputies. Nice day for a murder. <laughs> James fucking cag me. The public enemy, not public enemy. Yeah, exactly. Well, thank you, Meg. I knew that. I just don't know why I didn't say that. I'm fucking Time for bed. Alright, dude. I'm glad you enjoyed the movie though. Uh you did enjoy it though, right? Yeah, you fucking enjoyed it. It's good. Those kids, hey, interesting fact, Peppo. Those kids in that movie were a real gang. They weren't actors. They brought them in to do, they just played themselves. And the guy that plays young James Cagney at the start of the movie is actually part of their gang. The real gang. They're called the, uh, the Dead End Kids. I'm serious, yeah. They're called the Dead End Kids. And apparently they gave hell to Bogart on set. They were they were pranking Bogart constantly, and Bogart hated them badly. Uh, but they all wish they were all terrified of Cagney. They gave Cagney so much so much respect on set. But Bogart they fucked with. <laughs> Cagney is is the is an alpha. He's alpha as fuck. All right, let's jump in. Oh. Yeah, dude, fuck that ending. Oh, that ending's horrific. Luck with a new character? Uh, yeah, he's the exact, he's the polar opposite of Baz, dude. I'm gonna need it. People are gonna start shitting on him, but it's whatever. <sighs> oh, God. Away, you little shit. What? <laughs> I'm sorry. No, no, fuck off. Why you gotta be so mean? You just pull, pull the gun. Don't think I did. I, I, I know what you're gonna do. I wasn't gonna do anything. Going straight for the uh, the register there, right? Mm. Yeah, I've been around long enough to know. There's the door. Yes, sir. What a dick. <laughs> <laughs> All right. So his walk is Greenhorn, and I'll tell you why. Because he, if you just stand still, he'll start fidgeting and shit. You wait. Wait for it. He's gonna do it? I love the Les voice. How could you possibly beat up Les, man? Mr. Boyd. Actually, I need a newspaper. I gotta give, I gotta give the newspaper to, uh, to the sheriff. I'm gonna go get some money and buy a newspaper for, uh, for Banks. Let's take the jacket off. Jacket off. Shirt. Pull the sleeves up. Yeah. He sounds like a hell self from Harry Potter. Yeah, he does. He does. For sure. Alright, we got some we got a coffee. Oh by the way, this newspaper here, check it. Check it. I tell you why I got this paper. Because I caught a fish on Les and we made the paper. A royal catch. Les Darcy was was being taught how to fish in the Kamasa River by Sheriff Banks when his rod was pulled taut. Mr. Darcy was also was almost yanked off his feet and pulled into the swamp before he had the chance to reel the, in his line. <clears throat> he came out when it, what came out of the water was the king of the catfish, Bertrude. The fish was four foot long and weighed as much as a young man. 
Les shared the fish at a local barbecue. If you're looking for catches just as big, cast your line near Rhodes. He made the fucking paper, dude. Les is Mel Molly? No, because Molly's not innocent. She's just, she sounds innocent and sweet. But Molly's not scared. Les is fucking terrified. Les, Les makes Molly look like the, like a, the arch fucking outlaw. The only thing they have in common is they both stutter. Other than that, they're nothing alike. Molly actually has some bite to her. If you piss her off, uh, she, she, will, she will lay into you, dude. She's not scared like that. This character, look how he walks. <laughs> this character is fucking terrified of everything. He's like scared of his own fucking shadow. Let's sweep. This is, and welcome to, well, welcome to the Les gameplay. It's going to be a lot of sweeping. And once that rain stops, we're going to go jump in some puddles. <laughs> This is Les. This is this is our life now. This is our life now. We need some innocent music to play. What's a, what's a nice innocent music soundtrack we can play in the background here? Is Sheriff Banks on. I heard he was. We'll run to him. Mary Poppins. No, we can't put copyright. Um. Royalty free. What's it? What's the genre? Like, like something perky, something fun. Polka? What's fucking polka? What's polka? Let me do this. What is this? No, we're, 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 <laughs> we're, we're, no, no, that's not what we need, <laughs> we're not fucking, we're not, we're not, ragtime? Yeah, okay. Okay. Sweep no more. Eh. Eh. <laughs> oh boy. You know what Baz would be doing right now? Blowing all his money in fucking blackjack. But look at us. We're solid citizens. <laughs> this is what I do on Les, by the way. This is it. This is it. You guys wanted it. This is what you get. It's... Did you even do eight hours of Les voice? Probably not. All right, now we, we've done that. Now we can do the fun part. You ready? You ready for the fun part? The climax? Here we go. Detail. Porch. Spotless. And it sweat, sweat, spotless. Sweat, spotless. We place it. Do you guys want to do, do you guys, should we clean the roof? Get the webs off the window. <laughs> Do the fucking windows. Clean them windows. Oh. I don't have a bucket. Maybe they won't notice. Sounds like Lady Gabrielle is making money on the side again. Your pocket's deep enough. She'll share a bed for a spell. Window wiped clean. There we go. Now we gotta climb up and do the roof. Eee. Liz is a slacker. <laughs> No, I'm a slacker. I'm gonna take full credit for cleaning things, okay? Shut up. All we want is Banks to roll into town and see this. And just see us sweeping the roof. Where, where, where's Banks?
Thanks, man. Make the shingles shine. I'm trying. I'm, I'm trying. To your charge. Nothing. I'm learning to be a man. Oh. Well, who told you this is where you start? M Mr. Boyd, th 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 the sheriff. Uh, no, don't listen to them. Listen here. I've had a long life. I've lived it well. Many women. That's where you start, son. What do you mean? Yeah, your first kiss. Have you ever had your first kiss? No, but I went on a date and I got to hug her. Her name oh. was Doreen and she's a deputy. Very nice. Now, how old is she? Uh, mm, older than me. Ooh, an older woman. Yeah. What does she look like? She good looking? She's got the most beautiful eyes in the world. Well, that's a bit. Okay. Well, whatever you say. Uh, so you uh, well, you do this for free? Is that what you're telling me? Yeah, it's. Come on then. But. Yes, sir. You been with the spirit? <laughs> Hell. What the fuck are you doing? Oh, there's a, there's a big puddle there. Come on, you little oh, shit. Um, uh, sir, I'm supposed to be cleaning the office. Uh, you are cleaning. Mine. Well, all right. See up there? Bloody hell, I've not been up there in a while. Old knees, you see. If you can get up there and uh, sweep all that shit off, uh, there'll be a little uh, little payment in there for you. You know, I'd pay my staff well. All right, sir. I'll get right to it. All right, up you get. <coughs> Don't look through the windows. That's where I live. Yes, sir. Good lad. All right, I'll be inside. Great. Great. This is feeling so weird. <laughs> I told you, he's he's going to be a very... But just imagine this. Imagine this. Imagine if this character ends up being a badass deputy. Can you imagine the story arc that that would be? Imagine. Imagine if he... he I, want, I want the moment that he gets the badge to be massive. Like, holy shit. Les is a fucking deputy. I didn't want just I didn't want to just make a deputy character that's already a badass and ready to get onto the job. I wanted to create someone that doesn't look like that he doesn't look like he's got the potential, but but the sheriff does see the potential and he's he's trying to mold him into a deputy. I think that's I think it's gonna be so interesting. Alright. I cleaned that part.
Uh, Stand from the bottom, dude. Stand from the bottom. I support Liz. Uh, do you have a voice as Sheriff planned? <laughs> no. I mean, I could just go, My name's Liz. Don't fuck with me. Or I'll fuck you up right now, son. <laughs> just lower, just lower the tone a little bit. Without the, without the stutter. Yeah, that's right. I'm a deputy now. And I don't take no shit from no one, you hear? <laughs> Could do something like that. But now, we're just going to start sweeping. <laughs> <laughs> Needs to be deeper. My name's... No, no, no. It's, no, we got, we got the voice. Hey, shut the fuck up. I got the voice. He's gonna yell at me for not working. You watch. Yeah. Sir! I got all the webs off the shingles. Uh, I have to tell you, in fact, I'm gonna have to go up onto the bathhouse here and have a look down, because I can't climb up. Yes, sir! Start sweeping, Liz. Let me see you sweep. Do it. Fucking animation. Come on, get in there. You make me look bad. Do it, Liz. Let. Oh no. Liz, you let you let me down here, bro. Yeah, good job. Oh. Yeah, we're getting paid, boys. We're getting fucking paid. That's absolutely right, dude. Sorry, I'm not, no, I'm not gonna do that. <laughs> Just break into Baz. All right. Well, let's go and get some uh, pavement. Yes, sir. Les voice could turn to my normal voice, yeah. Good. Okay. There you go. Thank you, sir. C could I get a paper for today? Uh, oh, actually, yeah, I have one on me. There you go. 50 fucking cents! That's a dollar. 50 cents! You fucking... What? A dollar? Yes, sir. There we go. The oh, fuck, dude? Thank you. No, I'm... thank you. No fucking scam, dude! I paid him $50 so I could do his roof and get a paper out of it. Oh, that's it. I'm robbing a bank. Let's do it. <laughs> you know you're out no one telegrams yeah. Les, man. But then again, no one has telegrams. Num no one has his number. What is my number? I don't even know, I don't even know what a telegram is. We should go check that. Skip all the way down, Les. Is that Ryan? Who? I don't know. I don't know who that. Who's that? Oh, that's NPC. These are. This is Banks's binoculars, by the way. These are owned by the SCSD, the share. The uh, Saints Crossing Sheriff's Department. I could get in trouble for having those, but they were given to me by Banks, and he hasn't asked for them back yet, so I haven't given them back. 
corruption. You should get fired, man. You're right. You ain't right in the head. You know what's funny? Les knows information that no one else really knows about. I know that that Les knows in character that Braithwaite has admitted that he killed Nelson, his wife. Because he told one of the sheriffs, and one of the sheriffs pulled Banks aside and told Banks, and uh, Les was hiding hiding outside the window, and he listened to it. But he doesn't know who Braithwaite is, but he knows. He knows information that other people in the crossing don't know. Uh, hello. Great. How are you? Not sure yet. My 348. Pardon? I'm sorry, what? What did you say? Oh, I said I'm not sure yet. I'm still reading the telegram, see if it's a good or bad day. My telegram! 348. It's kind of feeling like a bad day. That's probably not good. What day? Bad's day is like not a good one. Oh. About you, are you alright? Yeah, I just got a job. Oh, that's nice. What kinds of job did you get? I was sweeping the roof. Oh, that sounds like a job. Yeah. I made f 50 cents. Oh, he was a high roller. Yeah. I like your hat. Thanks, he's got lots of dried blood on it because I stuffed it in a hole where a lady was bleeding out. I think I saved it now. You saved somebody? I think so. I saw her walking around the other day, so I guess she didn't die. You're a hero. Yeah, I'm a person what's got a ruined hat, is what I am. Mm, well, you can get that clean. I don't know. Can you get blood out of fuzzy hair? I know I paid 50 cents, damn it. Maybe I'm a very good cleaner. I should offer to clean my head for me. If you'd like me to. Oh, my angel, alright. Come to the bathhouse. You doing alright? Yeah. 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 <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> I'm skipping. It's fun when there's a puddle. Did you know that life isn't about waiting for the storm to pass, but learning how to dance in the rain? The dance, the dance in the rain. Sometimes, look. Actually, that's pretty good. You didn't even <laughs> wait for the rain. <laughs> Hey, you know, you really morning, take your love, buddy. Know, whatever you takes it, boy. Yeah. I don't know what she said. I'm just agreeing. Uh, is this the male version of Molly? No, Molly has way more balls than Liz. Way more balls than Liz. <laughs> Didn't last on DB. I see. No, dude, I, I couldn't. I couldn't. I got, I got, uh, my MMR's too high now, dude, where the games are just, I can't. It's, it, I can't play it. So what's been upstairs besides learning how to dance in the rain and sweeping? My friend, Mr. Boyd, the sheriff, he's teaching me how to be a man. That's what's the thing can be taught? Yeah, he 
to be fishing and hunting and he wants me to be a deputy one day. Did you want to be a deputy? Yeah. I want to help people. That's nice. I'm certainly trying. I mean, you've offered to, to help me with my bloody hands, so that just starts to things. Yeah. You can give me the hat and I'll wash it up in the bath. Alright. Okay. Mm, come on in. And give me that hat. Is yours? No, I don't smoke. Oh, I must have left it here the last time I was here. There's a lot of blood and mud on this. Yeah, it's pretty ruined, but uh, I know where the blood come from, but the mud, actually, I think I know where that come from too. a little while look um i don't remember us anymore but i've been here a bit that's nice i've Easy. only been here for a week a week and you're already thinking about being a deputy yeah it's got a little bit more blood but i'm getting it I believe in you. How do you spell vigorously? <laughs> Vigor. Is it vigorously? Let's see. Is it vigorously? Is there not an O there? Vigorously. Yeah, I got it right here. Yeah? I got it. They put into the efforts in the days. Yeah, there we are. You might want to not wear it yet till it dries, but look. is gone. Holy shit, she did get it out. Look at you. There you are. What the fuck? Who's this guy? Oh, I'm gonna get robbed, aren't I? I appreciate it. You're most welcome. When you look at it in the mirror, you're gonna look splendid. Dude, he's gonna get. Uh, this is oh, this is the most robber. It's so nice not to be covered in blood. People always look at me really funny with a bloody hat on. You're gonna look great. That man was looking in the window. He was peeking into the windows when we he was in the bath. He was watching us in the bathroom. Did you know him? No, never seen him. 
Liz Lurs growing on me? Thanks, dude. You want me to go ask him if he got some problem? Mm, he looks like a scary man. I wouldn't. I mean, watching a puppet in the bath is probably not the safest thing which you could be doing with your life. I could ask him. Yeah, but what if he beats you? Ah, uh, then you guys can help me. Oh, mm, but you could get blood on your clothes. Well, then maybe you just go wash them too. Mm, uh, I'll be behind you. I hope this guy's not violent, because I'd... Oh. Look at his walk. So as Les, the thing about Les is he's going to be... He's going to be a bit of a... A man whore, I think. He likes the women. And uh, that's going to be his flaw, I think. Hola, amigos. Oh. Hi, Is. Stage one. How are we doing today? I'm doing splendid. How are you? I'm doing wonderful. She got out of a nice warm bath. Oh, nice warm bath. Jesus Christ, I'm gonna get a drink. How early for this? Oh, you offering? Huh? Oh, I thought she was offering us drinks. I don't have enough money for that. This guy gonna come over and offer me a shares. job where I can pay him money to work. Whiskey. Nah. What the hell? Is that Mama? <laughs> fuck you too, amigo. No, fuck you, amigo. He doesn't drink. He drinks milk. It? There you go. He doesn't drink alcohol. God. He's scary looking. I'm not sure he's worth the efforts. Maybe it's best we don't do anything. I think she just goes to pick the right time. What do you mean? Way to the store. So he was watching us through the bathroom windows? Definitely. He was peeking right in for quite some time. There's a snitch. Uh, yeah. He wants to be a lord, dude. It's kind of. One of their main traits, isn't it? He went for, he's gonna get dressed. I went for the back. He went through the back door. Yeah, I see him. He's coming around. Oh God. Oh God, what is happening? Let's investigate. Les wants to be, he wants to be a, a lawman. I'm going to investigate. You go through the front door. The fuck you doing, boy? <laughs> um, I wasn't doing anything, sir. I'm sorry. Just getting an idea what it's like to be a people. Maybe you could give some tips. <laughs> You're a people. We spotted you. Our 
were very loud in there, you know? You were busted! Busted? Yeah, you were w w watching the bath! Okay. No, it's not okay. You don't watch people's in the bath. Okay. Is that it? What else you want from me? Yeah, you should st stop it at once! Or I'm gonna tell the sheriff on you! Tell him! I dare you! Oh! I dare you! He wants to be known as the people of the bath? Oh! I think he's mad! Night, Skeet! <laughs> We lost your toe. Get out of here. We we're not scared of you. Yeah, why don't you get out of here? Oh shit! Get the fuck out of here. <laughs> sheriff! Sheriff! There's a man behind the saloon and he just shot at me! What do you mean he shot at you? He shot! He's shot this way! Him. Yes. Thanks, baby! Come on! Thanks, Crossing Sheriff's Department. We're there he is. Over there. Running that way. Get him, Banks! Get him! <laughs> yes! Get him! Get him! Oh, shit! He went to the right, not to the left. This way! This way! <laughs> he went to the right! Get, please get him, please get him! Oh, please let Timmy got away! Fuck! Fucking bitch ran! Did he go, Liz? <gasps> He went to the right. I've lost him. I. What was he wearing? He was w wearing black, with a black coat, long hair, and a moustache. Right, um, I think he circled back around to town. He has right, let me look. hair and a ponytail. Probably find him peeping in the bath again. That's where we see him at first. All right, you in the bath together. No, I was washing her hat. Yeah, he's washing my hats for me. What, washing your hat? Yeah. That, like, I'm getting quite old now. That doesn't mean something else, does it? <laughs> her hat had blood on it. And I offered to clean it. You got it all clean. It looks real good now. Oh, all right. I'm still not committed. All right. Um... Who's your friend, Liz? This is a good. Sh what was your name again? Poppy. 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 Yeah. Right, no, nice to meet you. Um, my name's uh, Sheriff Banks. Uh, this is Les. He's a. He's a friend of mine. Uh, so I'm just gonna go into town. Just stay near the sheriff's office. Mate. Yes, sir. Oh, Isn't it weird having Banks in our team? Isn't it weird, but so cool at the same time, that these characters are so polar opposites? Oh man, if he had caught that guy, it would have been such a highlight. Fuck, he got away, little bitch. Being all tough-like, and he runs. Then he runs away like a little bitch. That's right. That's right. He ran away like a coward. Bitch. Little bitch. You think he heard me yelling for the sheriff? Is that why he ran? I bet he ran all the way out to town like a coward he is. Yeah. I should look for him in my horse. Love. 
I'm sorry, what did you say? My horse is named Love. Oh, alright, I thought so, never mind. I need to chew some fucking gum. I'm gonna ask the guy if he knows what his name is. Oh, is he already talking to him? Honestly, Liz. Yeah. Did you try and start a fight with this fella? No. He was peeping on us in the bathhouse. So we said kindly to stop peeping. And then he said, What are you going to do about it? I said, oh, I'm going to tell the sheriff. And then he shot at me. Well, straight away, did he didn't hit you, right? I don't need to get you a doctor. No. He Missed. Yeah, he's a shit shot. Jesus Christ. Um. All right. Uh, what, what did this fella sound like? Did he have an accent? Oh, yeah, he had an accent. The but fella he... down there says something like Mexican or Spanish. Yeah, Mexican. Long black hair, moustache, black clothes. All right. Well, you're safe now. Let your heart come down. You're going to feel sick in a minute. There'll be adrenaline taking over you. Mm, yeah. Mm, I got something for you, Mr. Boyd. What, what have you got? Hey, you kid. I haven't read the paper today. You're not going to it again, have you? No. But I cleaned the porch and the window. Beautiful. You have been busy today. Yeah, and I cleaned the roof too. Cleaned the roof? Yeah, I got up there and I swept it. Just be careful. You remember like, what happened last time you got on the roof? Yeah. Listen, uh, the other day, um, you, uh, you ran off. No big deal, all right? Mm -hmm. uh, I'm sorry. I was just afraid. All right to be afraid. Just, uh... You know I'm not gonna hurt you, right, kid? Yes, sir. I'll tell you something's not right if I... I point you in the right direction. It's not because I'm gonna hit you or... Anything like that. I just... Listen, I'm not good at this. I'm sorry you... Probably a million better people out there than me to teach you some of these things. I don't think so. I think you're a great sheriff and you're going to help me become a great man and deputy. It's going to be very hard to kill base now. Real work's up to you. I'm ready for the next lesson. You sure? Yes, sir. Right, uh, what was your name again, Miss Poppy? Yeah, it's Poppy. Is that how he fidgets? How long is, uh, is he's been speaking to you for? How would you say, roughly? Yeah, 10 minutes, 20 way. minutes? I mean, it's been a, a bit since I was at the telegram hey. station. All right, so, uh, what would you tell me about Poppy here, Liz? You want me to do? Hold on a second. 
What we gotta do is a lawman is be able to look at people, have a short conversation, and work out things about it. What can you tell me about this lady? Oh, it's taking me five minutes. One moment. <laughs> now it's awkward. What's up? I didn't mean to make it awkward. What have you done? I'm, I'm gonna give you a hug. Yep. I made this really nice dinner for you. You didn't touch it. It's in the fridge. I'm gonna have it now. No. Oh, have it in a bit. I'm gonna go to bed because okay. I'm gonna wake up early. All right, I'll be there soon. Ish. Nice. Be careful. The room needs clean. It yeah, I know. It smells like grapes. Would you get out of my grape room? I gotta come up. I gotta. I, what? I gotta come up with information I know about her. I love you. I love you too. Ugh. All right. Eat your dinner. All right. Observations. 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 I've only known for 20 minutes. Who knows it? Very cost efficient. Come on, come on, keep. What do you know? About her? Yeah, well, not about me. Well, by the way, she. I don't want to offend her or anything. It's all right. I get offended almost every day. Well, I, I just observation, that's all. Um, well, sh she's dressed uh, in a way that would suggest she m may have grown up rough. Uh, maybe a rough place. And maybe you lives in the street. All right, let me put this cigar out. I guess that was a good choice. I think your hair caught fire there. <laughs> Jesus, you're here, right? Oh. Oh. Okay. Let me just compose myself. She likes to smoke. And... Uh, hello, everybody. Uh, hello. Um, <laughs> where was I? Oh, boy. What was his name again? Um, Fishing Friend. Hello! Hello, hello. I forget your name, but I remember going fishing with you. My name's Leslie. Les, that's right, Leslie. Hello, Les. How are you? Um, a bit dented, but never worse for wear. Oh, you look n nice still. Oh, thanks. I think Mr. Hink just helped stitch me up a little bit. But yeah, a little bit. Oh, that's Ooh. him. That's him. Hello, Poppet. How, how's your wounds? The ones where I stuck your hold of my hat with. Oh, um, better now, I guess. Um, well, Chat, we need more observations. Better, but then I also just got chomped on by a wolf, Help so me be smart. I'm missing a few of them. I figure when the doctors come around, I can get them to sort of, you know, fill in all the missing bits. Get him, Banks. Get him. Yeah, I can see that. Yeah, that might be all right. Yeah, mostly. How are you? Um. Well, ain't that a peculiar oh, way to be, okay. mister? Sorry, I kind of left a bit of blood on it and stuff. That looked suspicious. Mm hmm. Clean is good. Pop it, right? Yeah, that's me. Hello. Hello. We we met once before, I think. <coughs> oh, yeah. Think I think so. I think so. All right. Was it good? I'm just joking. Away. Don't actually help me. You? I got this. It was a long time ago, maybe. We Beautiful. can say that she's uh, kind-hearted. She used her own hat to save a life, which means she has a nice heart. I wasn't worried for you. Um, if she didn't have a nice heart, she wouldn't oh, do that. So some sort of um, she sh also shows she can, she can think on her feet. If she hasn't got medical supplies with her, she can fit on her, think on her feet to find a solution to help someone as well. That's good, because I don't usually... She's pretty. <laughs> you want me to drop that? We can drop the pretty part. We can, we can do that. Puppet saved my bacon after the whole Leo thing the other day. This guy's blaming everything on me. He's blaming everything on me. Brandishing a firearm, dude. I got fucking 20 minutes for that. And I didn't even shoot. Help me find You better lock him up, Banks. Put her hat on my cuts. 
get her stuff to, to make sure that she didn't bleed out. And then, he, wait, you know him over there, right? Um, well, uh, maybe. Everybody keeps changing outfits and I don't really remember. But I can't remember. Oh, well, he cleaned my hatch for me. It was all nice and clean again. Oh, that's good. That was nice of you to help out like that, though. Hmm. Baking soda will get the blood out. Or so will like a vigorous wash in the bar. That'll do it too. Mm-hmm. Maybe they're putting the baking sodas in the bar. Oh, yeah. If we've mm -hmm. only got like a mm -hmm. big injury in the circus, we just fill a tub with bicarb and shove a whole bunch of clothes. Is he gonna lock him up? What's going on? Good scrub around, and it all comes out a bit. He can blame me if he wants, him. but he brandished a firearm. Mm -hmm. So he's got to go. He's got to go. All right, I'm glad you said you're not dead. Me too. I rather like being not dead. Not dead is so much more fun than dead. Mm-hmm. I mean, it certainly keeps your options open, I guess. I, I'd agree with that. All right, but I want to keep you. No, that's all right. Oh, you pop it. Well, it was nice seeing you. Oh, it's a pleasure to see you. Well, you're British and fine. You're right. He's got to go. All right. Well, did, did you? Did, did, and he's come back, old face. Did you wanna... What? Isn't that the guy? Yeah. The sheriff's talking with him. All right. I'm gonna get some water. And I'm starving. You love Les? Thank you, dude. He's very different. So I appreciate the kind words. You can see why I would never stream him on prime time, though. A lot of the people uh, during the day wouldn't be nearly as patient with him as you guys are. So thank you for that. Why didn't they fill my water up? Get yeah, fucked. Need be surprised. Oh, fuck. Back in the office, I'll speak to you in a second, kid. Get back to the office, I'll speak to you in a second, he said. We'll wait right here for him. Can we sit on this? Sit. Come on! You mean there's no chair? Get fucked. How does it? Doing it, really. Where they go. Thank you. 
<laughs> the lens. They're walking right behind me. <laughs> if anything, it sounds like you uh, intruded on their privacy first, and then maybe, maybe they have to uh, go buy something in the He's going into jail. Yes. <laughs> Yeah, that's Les, man. Jumping on the fucking rooftops. See what I jumped over directly over them? Oh, that was so good. <laughs> Such a snitch. Yeah, he wants to be law, man. One of the requirements. Reporting broken laws. <laughs> My first citizen arrest. <laughs> That's the first time he's uh, said something that's led to an arrest. That was big. When he gets out, he's going to want to beat Les, I think. This is scary. That could be funny, too. <laughs> Brown Samurai, I think for the two months. I followed Baz from the start and thank you, Verts, for making me excited. Happy, sad, angry, scared, and depressed with every stream. Thank you, dude, for enjoying my content. Thank you for resubscribing. Appreciate that. It is SimDog, I think for the two months. Love the content. Keep up the great work. Thank you, bro. Lazy Cloud, thank you for the two months as well. He says, let's go. Great Hawk, thank you for the 10 months. Is this cuckold Baz Riggs? No, you fucking dickhead. <laughs> oh man. Uh, howdy. K's not working for me. I can't I can't ragdoll. I can't ragdoll. K, 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 K. Not no, not working. New character? Yeah, this is Les Darcy. Uh the most timid. Fragile, innocent man in all the crossing at the moment. And he's, he wants to be a deputy. And uh, he idolizes Sheriff Banks. This is a window peeper. Yeah, pretty much. <laughs> All this came from a window peep, dude. Oh, Les, Les is gonna get eaten up, dude, by bad guys if he ventures out too far. He's got to stay around the law. Here we go. Were you following that fellow around? No, sir. You wouldn't lie to me, would you, Liz? I w 
was watching what he was doing because he looks suspicious, but I didn't follow him off ran very long. Don't follow people who ran. Especially dangerous people. What if, what if he was a fucking kidnapper? What if he grabbed you, put you in your, on his horse and carried you out to a cabin somewhere, started doing wicked sadistic things to you? He, he would have... Do you like your ears, kid? Do you like your ears? There's people that would wear your ears on a necklace if you gave them a chance. He didn't have to shoot at me. No, he didn't, and that's why he's in a fucking prison cell now. But I don't want to see you get hurt. I don't want to turn up one day and find out you're in the fucking medical office bleeding. Yes, sir. This job is dangerous. Be smart, all right? And if you're going to watch someone, make sure you're not fucking seen. We talked about this. Well, did you see me when I was watching you back there? What, when I was in the office? No, when you went around the back. You mean when you were on the roof? Miss Rachel got set upon outside the saloon. Poor thing's face all black and blue. <laughs> yeah. If I saw you, that means he saw you. Also means Mr. Fucking slice your fucking ears off and serve you them for dinner. Saw you as well. I'll try to get better. Mm, but pop it. She's um. Uh, well, she's kind-hearted, and she cares about saving people mm, because she used her hat to. Stop a wound. Wait, who was it? Mm, she didn't tell me, mm, but she used the hat to cover it, which means she's resourceful and she oh, cares. Not bad at all. Clear! I need to pass. Is that Mama? You think she's trouble? That one? No, Poppy. Oh, Poppy. Uh, well, no, but she's mighty brave. She stood up to that man when he was being mean. Well, uh, what do you think being brave gets you? Could she have been shot? You're brave. You can get shot. I have my department around me. I've got my brothers and sisters with the badges on. There's a difference between brave and stupid, Liz. Oh, he called me Les what instead of kid. the difference is standing here or standing over there. We'll write it down. How's that book of yours coming? Good. Says he. Are you helped someone today, miss? I'm sorry, you what? I hear you helped someone. Stem some blood flow with a hat. Oh, yeah, that wasn't today, that was other days for you. Very kind of you. I mean, so I couldn't just let her bleed out. She was talking to me and everything. I think that was Mama that rode past. Was it something I said? Mm, no. He does that sometimes. Oh, right. You want me to put my cigar out? I know it really upsets you the last time. I'll just stand over here. It's all right. I'll put it out. You were... Mm, we could have got shot. 
Wait, go to what? We could have got shot. Yeah, I mean, if he had been any better with his gun, maybe. He's in jail now. Morning, friend. Oh, God, that's where he belongs. I don't see him. Has he come out? Oh, no. He's not going to be happy about that. He's going to come out and beat me. Do you want my telegram? Yeah, you watch my telegrams. What's my telegram chat? Yeah. Alright, so I'll just write it on the inside of my coat. Okay, you ready? Alrighty. M Y three four eight. Three four eight. Gosh, M Y. That's a pretty good one, my three four eight. What's yours? Oh, right, yeah, mine, all right, then. Mine is Q, Q, so that's the double Q. Back a bit. And then it's 766. Got it. You can spell, yeah, you can. <laughs> I think my hair's dry. Mr. Yankee. Yeah. Oh, look at you. So bad is now. Oh, that looks so much better. It looks better than it did before. It looks very fluffy now. How you been keeping? Been better. Take it one day at a time. I appreciate I that. You're welcome. I'll make sure it's not to be smoking cigars. And I, I never think that it might bother somebody's people like breathing and things. That is a hell of a thing to. You're talking about breeding. Breeding. Breed. Oh, oh, I thought you said breeding. Jesus Christ. Oh, that's a hell of a thing to think when you're first uh, thinking about things. Well, you just, uh, you know, when you. Anyway. Do you, you often have thoughts of breeding? No, not really, no. <laughs> not all, in fact. Oh, what a lovely day it is. The new outfit is. Yeah. It's good. Yeah. I like blue on you. Yeah, that's what the lady in the shop said. That blue looks good with my hair. It's by the window. Yeah, I can see that. What do you reckon, Poppet? What do you think Les looks like in his new outfit? I mean, I like red hair. Wait, are we talking about his outfit? Yeah. Oh, oh yeah, oh. that's nice. You compliment his hair if you want as well. <clears throat> I think I should have a bath. <laughs> Get the fuck out. How do you make us see Banks a sheriff as a good guy? You know how hard it's going to be for me to shoot that man now? I, I'm going to have to though, because Baz hates his fucking guts. And how devastated would Les be? Dude, when that guy shot at me, and I ran down the street and saw Banks show up, dude, that was so fucking awesome. That was so awesome. Yeah, he, Les's nickname is the Gingerbread Man because he's a super fast runner and he's a ginger. Run, run as fast as you can. You can't catch me because I'm the Gingerbread Man. Eh. Speaking of which, i got to buy some more chewing gum in case I have to run. Yep. Les would be the man to take down Jack Kettleman. Yeah, I'm sure. There's some Kerrigan cream. I'll drink that in front of him. 
What was I looking for again? Gum. Fucking two dollars each. What a rip. Okay. Let me get some actual milk so I can slurp in front of his face. Hold on. By the way, if you want to get some Kerrigan Cream merch, just put in exclamation point merch in the chat. Kerrigan Cream merch is now available. Howdy. You thought you dread. <laughs> I was just getting some Kerrigan Cream. Oh. <sighs> Told you not to drink that stuff. It tastes so nice. And it's so thick. What's wrong with a cup of tea? Mm, it's... I, I like milk better. I mean, couldn't you just put some of it in your tea? Mm. Right, have you been putting... Have you been putting that shit in my cup of tea? <laughs> yes, sir. <laughs> Kerrigan's oh. cream. <laughs> What's the matter? Nothing. I... Oh, fucking oh. unbelievable. Hey, have you not enjoyed the tea? Morning, mister. You no. Know, you know what it says on the bottle? What does it say on the bottle? <laughs> Straight from Baz to your lips. Disappointed. <laughs> I need like to go wash my face. <laughs> <laughs> Sounds like he puts a lot into it. Yeah, it's really nice. You should try it. <laughs> I mean, did you drink the whole bottle? I got a little bit. You want to try some? I mean, I guess so. I mean, if you're offering. Is he alright? You... I, I might be having a reaction. Yeah, taste that. But make sure you open your throat because it's very thick. Should I be worried about a reaction? I don't want to choke. No, it's very nice. Trust me. Alright. <laughs> the cream always rises to the top. Um, it has like a lavender aftertaste, but it's so nice. Amazing. I mean. I mean, it goes down a little smooth, but. It does yeah. have a lavender aftertaste. Yeah, give it back. I want to drink more. All right, then. No. It's to, time to wean you off milk and get you on solids. Okay, one more drink. No, you, you go. <sighs> That's good stuff. Listen, that stops here. None of that bullshit anymore. Oh. Oh, you really don't like cream. Not that shit. I'm gonna, I'm gonna get you a fucking beer. <laughs> oh, wait, so I guess a beer too. I've never had a beer. <laughs> Wean him off milk. Oh shit. Oh boy. <laughs> Oh, God.
what drunk Les. I'm gonna Baz. I play him. I'm gonna play him tomorrow morning, dude. During the day, peak hour. Uh, are you guys enjoying the Les stream? I hope you are. Right, one beer, please, barkeep. Strongest what? one you got. What if I don't like it? What do you mean everyone likes beer? Mm, mm, okay. It's good, it'll make your hair curly. That's what my. Uh, the man used to say. Shit. Um, listen, give it back. Yeah, are you sure? Yeah. Gotcha. Gotcha. <laughs> uh, listen. He's uh, gonna be like his Bobby, dad. You mind nipping into the shop for me? Uh, have another meal. Uh, alright. Oh, food banks. Sorry, kid. <laughs> he felt bad. Oh, I made Banks feel bad, dude. That was a good moment. That was a good moment. He doesn't want to be like, like Les's dad. Oh, shit. What should I do here? What's the play? Is he leaving? Oh, he's leaving. Oh, no, he's hitching. He's, he's just hitching. Sorry, got a bee in my body. You can enjoy whatever you like. Uh, I, I don't want to let you down. Hey, let me down, kid. Listen, I've been speaking to a few members of the department. Um, said you like to dance, right? Yeah, when I'm happy. There's a... Deputy named Ripley. He works in Saint Denis. Um, she used to dance, do lots of stuff on the stage, be harsh, harsh like. She said uh, she can teach you some stuff. I don't know the first thing about dancing, so. You, you just have to uh, enjoy yourself and let your body do the talking well you could do it i don't think things so, are kid i've never been a dancer well i've never been a hunter or a fisherman but you helped me no nah, you did that kid not me <laughs> i also never run as fast as the horse and you did that Hey, yeah, that's why they call me the gingerbread man. Throw it down. Run, run, yeah. run as fast as you can. You can't catch me because I'm the gingerbread man. <laughs> yeah, and when you're a lawman, you can't run from me, motherfucker, because I'm the gingerbread man. Um, yeah, yeah. <laughs> um, I, I, I better go to bed. All right, kid. Um, yeah. Thank you, Puppet. Mr. Boyd, have a lovely day. Catch all the bad guys. Yeah. Oh, except, we'll... except for Baz, please. All right. Someone has to, right? Don't you catch Baz, you son of a bitch. Hear me? You definitely you, you, you can catch me. You yeah, fucking. <laughs> Wait, what am I supposed to do? <laughs> Come on, son down. of a bitch. All right, that's enough of Les for tonight. 
That's all we. That's all I got in me. Hey. Uh -oh. Yeah. Yeah. Take this with you. I'll help you sleep. It's another bottle of that coke and cream. Thank you, Poppet. You're welcome. Thanks for helping Have with my hike. Lovely day. Yeah, I'm gonna go find a box to sleep on for a little while. <laughs> Bye. Someone's seen the clip of me <laughs> turning into a bears. All right, that was good. What do you guys think? What do you guys think? Different. Different, but fun. I had fun. God. A villain? <laughs> Alright, let me... Let's, is he is he streaming? Is Panda streaming? We'll go to him. E easy host. Easy host. Where is he? He, he is. Okay, cool. Let's send you to... Let's send you to Panda. Send you to Sheriff Banks. I'm glad that you guys got to see another side of him because uh, he's the villain in uh, in Baz's story. But in Les's story, he's the hero. And I fucking love him. I think he's a great role player, great streamer. Show him some love, show him some support, give him a follow. Uh, any, anything more you want to do? By all means. Really cool guy, you can't go wrong. Great, great role player. Uh, Nalby, thank you for the five gifted subs to end the stream. Appreciate that. And Oritis, thank you for the 12 months, one year of support. Um... Yes, it was different. Les is very different. Um, I'm glad I got that out of my system and done a stream with him because um, I really like him. He's, he's, a, he's, a, he's going to be a very, very slow burn. Uh, and uh, I'm not going to rush that. And um, yeah, I hope you guys join me for the ride um, because if we ever put Baz on hold, uh, we'll probably do some Les uh, a little bit more frequently, even though it fucks my voice up a little bit. Anyway, uh, say hello to Panda for me. Uh, see all the love in the world. I'll see you guys tomorrow when I wake up and we'll do some baz. But till then, ta-ta and farewell. Bye. Hi, right, Pop. Thank you for fucking five gift subs at the very end. I'm sorry. I'm ending, but fuck. Thank you, I right, Pop. Now, I'll be thank you so much, guys. Bye.